getting to some heavy reading? Hey, I'm prepping for the Humpty Dumpty Challenge at All Saints Catholic School in Cedar Rapids. Interesting. Tell me more about this. Well, let's dive into the book. This is excellent. Don't yoke with me. I love an egg pun. So, tell me more about this challenge. In this challenge, the three-year-old preschool class at All Saints Elementary completed a Humpty Dumpty challenge as part of their parent night. Three years old? I have to think these are the youngest makers we've ever featured. They are. They did have some help since it was their parents' night. They worked with parents and siblings to not only make a Humpty Dumpty, but also one that can maneuver obstacles. Obstacles? You know, like sitting on a wall and surviving a great fall. I really like how the families participated together in this challenge, making as a team sport. I'm really excited about this challenge. We want you to keep this challenge open-ended. How can you help Humpty Dumpty survive his great fall? So Yokes, share with us your take on this classic nursery rhyme challenge. And as always, have, have fun, fun making! making. Humpty Dumpty. Humpty Dumpty. And what did you, how did you decorate your Humpty Dumpty? Using Humpty markers Dumpty. and stickers. Markers and stickers. Awesome. So what color hair does your Humpty Dumpty have? Golden. Golden. Awesome. 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 I mean, I made a, a boat with a sail. <laughs> we put a, we had two plates. And then we also add, um, um, wrapping this for, um, Humpty Dumpty seats. And what was the funnest part about making your boat? That we had a lot of ideas. And what did you learn from your dad? Your um, we should all take we should all take care of Humpty. I I add a, add some ribbons, then put these on set the other fell, so it would look like jets. They are jets. And and hunt. And I put a plate, and these are sticks that you have on lollipops. And these are paper towel sticks and tape. Can I say something? And Sean wants to talk to you. Humpty Dumpty, goodbye. It's called a montoon that we made. Um, I decided to bake it, but Max did most of it. He accidentally fell off one of the parts. Did you teach your brother anything while you were making this together? Yeah, we should all work together. Right, one more thing. And there's a paddle thing right here. So, jets and a paddle thing. It goes like this. It goes like this. Did you like making this with your sister? Yes. Yeah. Do you normally make things like this with your sister? No. Uh, fight about it. Yeah. Um, um foil string and uh and popsicle sticks and fluff balls. She helped me in to put a tin foil on. That was her idea. Whose idea was it to make a rocket? Mine. I love it. That's really creative. Are you proud of your rocket? Cool. Let's take it across the river. Hey, it's up to you. Foil. Tin foil. Well, it's really awesome. You were able to have your sister here to help. Very cool. What did you learn? I learned.
even met my brother has a big imagination. the wall so we didn't fall off. And what did you use to make your wall? Blocks. Blocks. Awesome. And where did you have to dump the end? In the middle. In the middle. Where did you put him in the middle? What? Why did you put him in the middle? Because it had like walls kind of like sticking up. Ah, so did that make it safe for Humpty Dumpty? Yes. Did he stay on the wall then? Yes. I don't think I like where this is going. Yeah.